Good evening and welcome to WSKI Channel 17, also available anytime at WSKITV.com. We are brought to you by 45 North, serving breakfast and dinner every day of every season in the Sugarloaf Hotel. Tomorrow is Friday, December 28th. We are looking at snow, folks. Get excited. Temperatures will be about the same at the summit and the base, 33 towards the bottom end and 37 towards the top end of the scale. It's looking like showers might hit after 4 p.m., but that's okay because the lifts will have stopped turning. Saturday, December 29th, it will be snow showers in the morning, clearing to partly sunny. 31 to 35 up top, 33 to 37 at the bottom, and temperatures will be steadily falling. The wind will be a little crisp. Make sure you keep your toes and nose warm. Our extended forecast looks great. Sunday, December 30th, partly sunny, 18 down at the bottom, 2 degrees up at the top. Monday is looking mostly cloudy, 30 down bottom, 20 degrees up top. And Tuesday, the first of the year, will be snow showers. What a great way to welcome in the new year. 35 down bottom, 16 degrees up top. We're looking at 63 trails running tomorrow. It is a machine-groomed hard pack, fast moving out there, some really, really great conditions. I heard fabulous things from folks all day long. Looking at the bottom of the hill, we have Snubber starting at 8 a.m., Sawduster and Skidway at 8.30, and 9 o'clock, the Muscalator will be running. Looking up towards the mid-mountain area, we are showing Double Runner East and Double Runner West, both starting off at 8.30. If you take a look towards the west side of the mountain, at 8.30, Skyline and Super Quad will be running, and at 8 a.m., West Mountain will be running, but that is for transportation only. Upper and Lower West is not open for skiing yet, folks. Stay safe. At 8.30, King Pine and Wiffle Tree will be making things happen up top. It should be a really, really fantastic day. 9 o'clock, Timberline, and the T-Bar will also be running. Gotta love those T-Bar skills. Scheduled grooming at the base area, Candy Side, Lower Winters Way, Boardwalk, The Landing, The Birches, Looking to Central Mountain, Upper Spillway, Sluice, Gondola Line, Lower Wedge, Timberline, Bridal Chain, Tote Road, King's Landing, Hayburner, Competition Hill, and Narrow Gauge. On the east side, we have Hallback, Widowmaker, Ram Down, Tow Hall, Whiffle Tree, Slasher, and Rollway. Scoot will be tidied up over on the west side, and I think we're going to let the terrain parks rest for the night. What a great team we have. It's looking so beautiful out there. Don't forget, the Outdoor Center is great. Over 60 kilometers of the cross country is groomed, and the snowshoeing trails are wonderful too. Don't forget, the, the rink is open, but you can also skate out on the pond. How fun. Friday, December 28th, 5 to 7 p.m. at the Outdoor Center, there will be a kids' dinner with Amos, Blueberry, and Pierre. Stories and ice skating, too. Reservations are required. Horse and carriage rides, 1 to 3 in the village also. Don't forget, we have the Charity Summit coming right up. December 28th, who is so excited? We've got the Climb for a Cure. Do some fundraising for the Dempsey Center. They have done so much to help this community. You know, it's it's really great. We've got to work hard to keep each other healthy. Don't forget, guys, it is watch and wind all weekend long, the 27th to the 29th, 7.30 to 9 a.m. and 5.30 to 7 p.m. You can reach us here at the studio at 237-6895. Again, that is 237-6895. Really excited for you guys to win some cool prizes. Talk to you tomorrow.